Hi, Carl here for Pro TV, and today we're taking a look at our range of soft lights from Lishue. These are LED panels just like the ones we're all used to. They are light and portable, can be run off batteries, and they don't get hot during use. All the normal benefits of lighting with LEDs. But what makes these lights different though is that they use an edge lighting technology. This means that rather than having the LEDs shining directly outwards like normal, they are actually arranged in a ring around the panel and bounced inwards. Because of this, they are a little less powerful than the traditional LED panels, but they give out a gorgeous soft light, which is really flattering to the talent. The other big advantage of these lights is how color accurate they are. I tested these lights myself this morning with our color meter using a TLCI measurement to judge each light. TLCI is basically a more modern replacement to the CRI measurement, which you might have heard before. It judges each light out of 100, and the basic way it was explained to me is that anything over 85 should have nice enough colors that a colorist wouldn't be wanting to correct the image. And then anything between 75 and 85 would need correcting, but be fairly easy to do. So we want our lights to achieve over 75, and preferably over 85. So here are my readings from these four lights, all were taken at exactly one meter away from the light in a dark room. As you can see, all four lights did well, but the larger panels definitely performed the best with scores into the 90s. That is a fantastic result. It means I wouldn't worry at all about the color of the light when using these on set. The smaller options did well as well, getting just under 80, which might not be quite as impressive, but for a small cheap light like these, it's really pretty good. So let's take a look at some footage. I lit the same scene with each of the lights, with the light in the same position and distance from our model Emma. Each light was at full power, and I adjusted the ND on the camera to vaguely match my exposures, as obviously the smaller lights get progressively less powerful as you go down the range. I also included a traditional LED panel, purely to see how much harder the light would be. So pay attention to how the shadows on her face change as the light source gets smaller. Personally, I think these lights are a great, convenient option whenever you need a soft, flattering key light. Traditionally, to get a nice, soft, flattering light like this, you would take a big, powerful light, bounce it off a panel, and through some diffusion. And that will always be the best way to soften your light. But it takes time and space to be able to do that. These lights are small, and they run off batteries. So if you are doing interviews in a small office, say, you probably won't have the time or space for a big lighting setup. So these lights would really come in handy. I think these are perfect for interviews and pieces to camera like this one. They can be set up in no time at all and create a beautifully flattering light really easily. We'll finish off this video with some nice glamour shots we did with Emma using the two bigger lights, the C1500 and the C700. More information on these lights is of course on our website. And if you have any questions at all, please just leave a comment below.